Hello Libra, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading for February 2021 for the sign of Libra. So let's pull your first card, Libra. Message for our lovely Librans, please. Message for our lovely Librans, please. Angels, Spirits, Guides, for February 2021. Okay, I'm going to pull one. So I have Nurture Yourself First, Libra. Nice message. Okay. So what is the message that Libra needs to hear, please? So we're going to pull a few oracle cards and then we'll pull some tarot cards yeah so the template i've just developed we have inspire passion life devoid of passion can be a boring uninspired blank canvas that slowly drains the soul now is the time to reignite your passions and rejoin life this is an opportunity to set new goals which will in turn reconnect you with all that is sacred so there's definitely an energy of find new passion here or maybe some kind of something is sparking your passion so what do we have for Libra, please? Is a message, angels, spirits, guides. What is the message for Libra? Okay. So Libra, I have number seven. I mean, seven is a master number, so do look that up. Um, very much connected to God, the divine, the universe. We have celestial gatekeeper. Timing is critical here. Hmm. Okay. And angels, what is the message that Libra needs to hear for February 2021? Message that Libra needs to hear, thank you. Thank you. I've got a dog. Be disciplined in your home and community life. Archangel Zariel. So there's something about being disciplined. Timing is critical. It feels about something, to, it feels like maybe act, something to do with passion, acting on your passion, something inspiring you, and, and definitely this energy of nurture yourself first. Okay, so I'm going to pull three cards, Libra. The first card is the message from Spirit. The second card is what this message pertains to, and... The action or advice, the third card is the action or advice from Spirit as a final message. So what do we have for Libra, please? Angels, Spirit's Guides. Message for our lovely Librans, thank you. Message for Libra. Message from Spirit, please. Angels, Spirit's Guides. What is the message from Spirit for Libra, please? Starting with the actual message itself. Thank you. So I have the Seven of Wands. The Five of Swords, Libra, is what this, what this relates to. And we have the Three of Wands as your advice, action to take. So the message here in Libra, we have the Seven of Wands, which is a card of, is somebody who is challenged, but they're actually on higher ground than that which opposes them, whether it's people or a person or a situation. This is about staying strong, being in your power, standing firm, standing resolute. And you will definitely overcome something. Uh, that this is a card of persevere, stay determined, stay in your power. You are getting on higher ground than that which opposes you, which is really beautiful. So it feels very positive there. The Five of Swords, Libra, is a card of conflict. And now that could be inner conflict. In, in which case, this is a kind of stand firm in terms of overcoming something. It's some kind of conflict arguments, disagreements. It is an energy of 
it feels for some of you, it is a negative energy, the Five of Swords. It can be when we're negative thinking, it can be to do with conflict in our external environment. Either way, there is definitely some kind of energy of stand firm, keep going, you will overcome something, and I'm definitely getting that kind of energy. Because <laughs> the action or advice from spirit, um, or final message, call it what you will, is there's progress. This is a card of expansion, the first signs of success coming your way. So this is a card of your ships are coming in. So in whatever context this is, something good is coming your way. And it feels like as a result of the actions that you've taken, there's progress, something good is coming your way. It feels very, very beautiful, Libra. So definitely an energy of stand firm, keep going, persevere. Whatever this conflict or challenge is in your life, whatever this five of swords, which can be arguments, conflict, this is about standing firm, being resolute, persevere, determine, keep going, because you will overcome that which opposes you. And definitely see some first signs of progress coming your way. So it feels very, very beautiful. So I'm going to pull a final message from Spirit. And I feel this is about the inspired passion here. <laughs> There's definitely this energy of nurture yourself, put yourself first, take care of you. This is about standing your ground. You will overcome something here. And again, the timing is critical. There's definitely this energy of just keep going. Yeah, there's discipline here, keep going, because for some of you, something good is coming your way. You know, this is a card of your ships are coming in, progress, expansion. Yeah, very, very beautiful. Final message for Libra, please. Final message for Libra, thank you. Final message for Libra, thank you. So we have, we rejoice when you find love. Love comes in unexpected ways, number 24. So, you know, for some of you, I mean, this could be that passion energy, but it can also be self-love, you know, that kind of energy as well, self-love, which is why you're being told to nurture yourself first, you know? So I definitely feel that something is gonna lift, something is definitely gonna be manifested here, Keep going. Remember, this is the first signs of success coming your way. Lovely energy. So I hope you enjoyed the reading, Libra. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.